that's bolted to concrete, dude. I ain't getting in anytime soon. So just to keep that in mind. So let's go ahead and quit wasting your damn time. Let's get to these uh, these biometric tests. Uh, this is a $300 vault tech supposed to be one of the better ones on the market. They say a lot of things about their scanner. So let's test it with the worst of my fingerprints. Here we go. It doesn't even detect that on there. So good job there. Let's go to the slightly dried out one. Or okay. I really was expecting a lot more than that from vault tech i'm highly disappointed all right man we need to talk about a few things right now man huh i look like an idiot all right we need to talk about a few things real quick man the vault tech look man i know my my tests are a little extra i don't expect any stupid morons to be as smart as i am and get the prints but the prints help you know a few things man they help you know if it has vein detection which the vault tech don't have okay because i can do this I can do this with a glove on, man. And there you go. <laughs> That's disappointing. All right, I wasn't expecting to get into this vault tag, man, with that uh, with a crusty old dry print, man. <laughs> Come on now. That's ridiculous, dude. I was expecting a lot more, man. There's no vein detection, man. There's nothing special going on here at all, man. So uh, when it comes to the to the finer details, and that's where my my tests show you, man. They show you the finer details. They show you if there's quality built inside, man. They show you they show you everything, man. But at the end of the day, yeah, this thing's pretty easy to, to pop, man. You can get in here with a damn dry print, which is, you know, really, really disappointing, man. I just want everyone to know that. I know my tests are extra. I don't expect any of you. you do, do I expect any of you like, picking perverts to have any of those skills either? Hell no, man. Actually, I'm, I'm showing you what, what people be doing. Prying and stuff, man. That's what, what's really going to happen, man. That's the only skills you have, you morons. So, yeah, man, highly disappointed in the vault tech, man. I really wish uh, this would have had some vein detection on there, man. I wish it would have required my uh, my graphite and fees glue. But, no, man, this thing just got in with a crusty old print, dude. So, yeah, that kind of disappointed in that, man. All right, man. Oh, Curry, uh, you know, man, don't forget to stick the like button, stab it, shank it. Shank that like button, shank it. Ah, shit. <laughs> Just kidding, man. Just kidding. Let's have fun with you, man. Chill out, dude. Okay, man. Everything looks okay. Let's do one last thing since I can't afford, man. I wish I could. I wish I could pry this damn thing open. But actually, man, after I had trouble prying up this piece of shit. Now, this is the Poverty Pony version of Vault Tech, right? And I was like, eh, it's made out of sheet metal. It's a piece of shit. Dude, this, thing, this piece of shit gave me way more than I bargained for, man. Look, look at this, dude. These damn shackles are still... Watch is still stuck in the safe, and this is a piece of shit. <laughs> if, this, if these things were attached to sheet metal better, dude, that would have been a huge problem, man. That is already hard enough. I'll tell you that. Look at that, man. It's stuck in there, dude. It's forever stuck in that piece of shit. That's the Poverty Pony. Now, this is the God tier version of that, man. <laughs> now, if you think you're going to get... If you think you're getting into this damn thing anytime soon... Holy crap, man. Don't send me $300. I don't want to even try to get into some bitch. Because this would be a hell of a day. <laughs> no, don't do it. Do not try to pry in this piece of shit, man. Because this would be one hard son of a bitch to get into, man. I'd, uh, these are screwed in here, man. Yeah, dude, it would be a bad day for you, man. So I would say this damn thing is going to be tough. Just watch my Sentry Safe, man. Watch my Sentry Safe video, dude. If you want to see how tough some of these things can do, that's just one latch. You imagine a quality piece like this with two latches, man. You're not going to be having a good day, dude. You're going to be having a bad, bad day, man. So I just want to throw that out here, man. I will say this is a tough son bitch. And, uh, you know, hey, if you like the biometric safes, man, then go ahead and get it, man. But if you want something even, you know, stronger and impenetrable and you can't pick, get a damn Fort Knox or, man, get a, a V-Line, man. Viking safe. Viking Safe has a simplex lock made in America, but the body's made in China. Just know that. So, give it a little discount, you know. <laughs> there you go. All right, man. Until next time, dude. I'll see you then, man. Support a helpless, helpless villain. Go to my website, xlogtactical.com.